Hello guys, uh, this is Jacob. Today I'm making this video to show you guys how to install Leta, uh, which is formerly uh, MemGPT on Kaggle. Uh, so you have a public URL you can access and test instead of the documentation. Um, it says um, you can only do it on localhost. So that being said, let's get started. So first you have to install a Leta, uh, as the documentation says, and then you also have to install Llama Index Llama. Uh, Llama index embedding so Llama because we're actually uh, using Llama to talk to the Lada instead of the uh, Open AI or Anthropic or uh, Grok. So I will use Llama. So then um, basically you have to install these dependencies. So and then after that we have to create a public URL using Grok. So it will um, basically uh, turn all everything from the notebook out to the public. So install the Py and Grok, and then Grok, and uh, after that, query function to run bash command within Python, and uh, get the Grok token from Grok console, and then after that, make sure you connect Grok to localhost 8283. So this is basically mapping the public Grok URL to a localhost, which is the Leta server. After that, you basically run the Olama install using one line command, and uh, spin up Olama in the backend. So. Download two models, uh, Llama 3.2 and also uh, the embedding model. Uh, you can use uh, uh, QN or uh, other maybe uh, six uh, bit or above models. Uh, they don't recommend uh, low like four bit models, so just keep that in mind. So we just use Llama 3.2 and uh, no no embed tags. And after you pull these models, make sure they exist. Do a Llama list to show if they actually exist in the Llama. And uh, also you have to update the settings. If there's uh, any uh, CORS, which is the cross-site scripting issues. So just add some local host and uh, also the uh, 0000 and uh, also the uh, local host uh, 11434, which is the LAMA port. So if you do have the uh, cross-site scripting issues, make sure you add those uh, in the CORS origins list. But if you don't have issues, uh, you can just uh, skip this, so it's optional. So the uh, settings file in the ladder folder. Um, but one thing to uh, notice actually is that so you have to use GPU T4. You, the P100 will not work for some reason. So make sure you use GPU T4. Okay, that's very very important. So if you use P100, it will not work. Okay, and let's continue. Uh, so then uh, make sure you set up the llama base URL uh, in the uh, environment variables to the localhost 11434 then start up llama uh, using this command instead of the official letter server so letter server start up llama in localhost which will not work for some reason on Kaggle so make sure you go to this folder which is the um, where the uh, lata installed so you go to the uh, conda as um, basically this uh, Python packages installed in the Kaggle, so it's actually in Conda, not the uh, default P folder. So uh, go to this folder, uh, Lada server folder, and then start up the uh, command using uvcon, not the Lada server as the documentation says in here. So do not use that, it will not work. So after that, make sure you specify localhost, uh, the host as the 0000, instead of localhost uh, loopback, address so and then special port as 8283 so then you will have um, basically the llama the lot of server set up okay and after that uh, just click the uh, public url we generated earlier click here you'll basically see this um, interface so this is the letter interface which is used to be called um, map gpt so uh, this is basically um, the interface you can try out you can create agent just click create agent uh, give a name, the model list uh, from Olama you can uh, choose from. You can choose the embedding uh, model from uh, the list as well. And uh, create a personal, uh, just create anything. You can create your own, add a template, create your own as well. Um, and then you can create user, uh, basically the uh, template or agent template in the uh, menu of bars. Um, but that's pretty much it. So, and you can click chat. So you start be able to chat with the uh, agent using this configuration that you set. So um, we can see um, you should be able to, uh, you know, take the information 
and then you can start chatting with the uh, agent that you created. You can have um, many, many agents. You just create one here. So with that being said, hopefully this is helpful. If you do like this video, please uh, subscribe, like, or comment if you have any questions. Thanks for supporting the channel. See you in the next one.